Hey everybody, it's Crumps2. Welcome back for, I believe, part 10 of Final Fantasy 2. And, uh, yeah, we are back over at, uh, well, over by the Finn area. We're not actually in Castle Finn yet, per se. But maybe that has something to do about where we're at here. Just, just maybe. What's this? I think you're blushing. Ah, uh, it's, ah, uh, nothing. It's, it's nothing. Don't ask. Everything's normal. Don't ask. <laughs> no, no, no. It's, uh, it's, it's fine. There was, there was no, you know, monster that overtook you and basically tried to, you know, seduce fuck me. It, it's fine. No, we're, we're good. We're good. Everything's fine, Hilda. Don't ask. Come on, Furion. Chop, chop. Let's do this. <laughs> Jesus. Gotta wonder what I'm thinking sometimes. All right. Anyways, like I was saying, maybe, just maybe, we head over to Finn. And, of course, there's a fight on the last fucking step. And, of course, they're gonna run. <laughs> I will never understand the logic of that. It's hilarious, but I'll never understand it. Anywho, like I was saying, let's go to Castle Finn. Maybe, just maybe, we can, you know, take this back. Ooh, with the help of Layla, too. Don't want to be hacking your way into enemy territory without me. Maybe I do. Layla joins. Woo! And then we cut out a hell of a lot of bullshit here because I'm not even gonna lie, this is like 20 minutes of running through this fucking castle. Um, it, it was just me being stupid. You literally just have to walk up the stairs and fight this guy. So I cut all the BS out because honestly, you missed nothing. Except for people turning into toads, which is why I showed you the, the screen there. However, Godos is the uh, the boss at the end of, of the, uh, the castle. The quote-unquote, you know, long hallway. Literally, you walk up like three flights of stairs and you're here. It's just the throne room. And yeah, <laughs> I figured I'd show you the fight, even though it takes all of five seconds, but <laughs> the frog running behind. God damn it, that's adorable. Downright adorable. <laughs> all right, so we took the enemy commander out. We take the castle back. Oh, it's good to be sitting on this completely oversized chair again. Man, my ass was just not doing well with those those little, like, you know, wooden chairs we had back in Altair. Just shit tier, telling you. <laughs> well, maybe I will go to Mysidia. Why should I go there, though? It's a land of mages. I like where we're going with this already. No, I know full well what Mesidi is. I love the fact that Mesidi is in this. And also in FF4, which is usually known as FF2. Yeah, that's... Because, you know, we don't need this to be any more confusing, right? Like, it's completely understandable. Alright, so we got ourselves a little password. We just don't know jack shit about what to do with it. I actually do, but you have to go trigger something else before the door opens. If I'm not mistaken, you may not have to, but I'm going to go do it anyways. I'm not really 100% sure. Anyways, the Ultima Tome's out there, which is pretty cool, so we're definitely going to Mesidia next. But as was said by Hilda, there is a white mask here in the castle, too, and we're going to need that before we head to Mesidia. You don't have to have it, but boy, if you don't, you're going to kick yourself in the fucking ass. Because actually, you do need it. Yeah, notice I almost went to where the hidden spot is there, but let's go talk to Paul, because that is what we're supposed to do. And here's the pathway backwards, just no enemies this way. See what I mean about running straight? You literally go straight upwards, and boom, you're in the, uh, the throne room where that enemy was. So all you missed was me getting turned into a toad. But he saw the toad! <laughs> so we're all good. How the hell have you been? Uh, do you know about a secret wall, buddy? <laughs> oh, you don't happen to want to tell me what's in there? Millions and millions of gill. Millions. And what do you need a white mask for? Well, you know, have you ever seen that one movie with Tom Cruise and Nicole Kidman? Don't ask. Just, we need a mask. Just shut up and tell me where it is. I was trying to walk there. Alright, so, um, funny part, I will actually forget about where this is, which is really fucking stupid, because once he tells me, it's like, but I thought it was, like, right here. It's literally right there. 
Okay, we're not gonna learn anything from the wall. Maybe we just, I don't know, say the secret word and walk through? I'm amazed you can't walk above that. And time for more battles because, for some reason, this castle is chock full of enemies that were just behind a secret wall that never come out and do anything. The strange things in life you'll never understand. Like, why on earth would they not come out and fight? I mean, these things are pretty fucking strong, as you can obviously see at the moment. Time to level some other spells, like Aura, for example. I was watching when uh, Slackaholicus did his playthrough and he came across it like, Boy, this is not descriptive. What in the hell does Aura do? I'm like, you're gonna want it, trust me. <laughs> You'll see later on it does actually power up your, uh, your fighters pretty damn nice. Which, thankfully, it did that after Spaz hit me, because, ow! <laughs> And I just did it again. I just realized now that I have that targeting Furion. Yeah, that's wonderful. Oh, that was like perfect damage on that too. Legit perfect damage on that. And here's me editing out more BS because, yeah, the, the the menuing in there took way too freaking long. So I just said, screw it. I just saved you guys a whole bunch of me literally sitting around in a menu doing nothing. You've missed all of boredom. And these things have some health. Holy shit. That second weapon. Ah, uh, we may want to get something else on Furion. Just saying. Right, which the hell way am I even going here? Well, it ain't that way. That's one, again, like, thank god I got all the health that I did. It's not entirely needed, but yeah, as you saw from the uh, the last round, you make one fuck up and it's pretty much gonna haunt you. It don't take much in this game. I'll never use. Actually, I might use that spider silk. Being that that will slow down all your enemies, at some point I may actually utilize that. Don't quote me. I probably don't. But it's a nice thought, if nothing else. Sorry for all the background noise. Again, I live in an apartment complex and there's all sorts of work going on from... Oh, that reminds me, my water's shut off. Uh, damn it. No shower this morning! It was actually the first thing I did when I woke up because I always have, like, the raspier voice going on, so I figured, eh, screw it, record something right away and then do everything else. Plus, it's, what, a whopping 17-minute video? Like, yeah, I think I can hold off on brushing my teeth for, like, 20 minutes. Even at that point, though, I can't really wash my damn toothbrush off, so maybe that's kind of not going to happen. Ugh, I hate sewer and water work. It's always so annoying. during all this as I'm just leveling up uh, other spells. It's like, all right, let's just kill off one enemy at a time very, very slowly. 
shells only at level three. Jeez. Yeah, we got a ways to go on those levelings. Yeah. Five out of six. Well, four out of five, actually. Oh, just pick a spell and fucking use it. It doesn't matter. It won't even cast, most likely. Totally useless. Ah, when Blink starts hitting, though, that's kind of fun. Because all of a sudden, nothing can hit you physically. There we go. And run through a corpse. Oh, it disappeared. Come on, that's no fun. More stalagmites. Jesus Christ, man. These actually aren't so terrible, but I don't think I ever really did figure out what their actual weakness was. I just kind of went at them with, like, you know, spells that I actually needed to level up. It's the usual way with this game. You don't really go, oh, hey, their weakness is insert name of spell. You just kind of go, well, I've got Blizzard at level 7. The other ones won't do any damage, so Blizzard it is. Or, obviously, teleport. <laughs> What in the hell? Walk away to close a window, come back, and it's like nothing changed. I know it's a different fight, but... Uh, speaking of those plumbing works that were going on, yeah, that was the beginning of it over there. At 11.30 in the morning. Because that's when I'd start work. fucking 10 p.m. Eastern. <laughs> I love third shifting, though. Something about third shift is just so much more relaxing to me. Speaking of relaxing, Spaz decided now might be a good time to hide behind human and take up half of the couch. Well, that didn't work. Too bad these guys don't have magic points. It's a good thing to level up Osmos, though, quite honestly. I mean, that is a ridiculously useful spell. You'll notice me use it later on, and it, it will literally hit for like three, four hundred magic points, and that's not even capped out on level, and not even close to capping out its level. So, it, it's, it's really nice. When you find an enemy that has magic points, you can actually steal, that is. I still don't even know what the hell those are used for. I know what it is, but I don't know what the hell the, uh, the, uh, the auriculum, uh, is actually used for. Don't believe I found a use for that in-game. And obviously, if you know, feel free to comment the way. Because I really don't know that I've used it. Although I could be thinking of uh, I Am Setsuna, where like, I'm pretty sure it's just going to be a, a sell-off item that'll wind up getting you abilities and such, but I found like five of them and no use for it whatsoever.
How are there this many stalagmites in here? This is literally an insane number. That we're almost through the place, though. I think that's, if not the last staircase, it's the second to last staircase? Pretty positive. on the way out. Uh, did I say staircase? Because there ain't no staircase here. There's a shitload of doors, though. Haha, <laughs> staircase. That one. <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah, all the other ones are empty, so don't even bother. But there's a white mask hiding way the hell at the bottom of this, this castle. Which, how do people not notice that this room in this whole area exists? Ah, oh, fuck. Stalagmites. Go about it the uh, the quick hit the ever living crap out of everything way. Well, the quicker, because let's be real, a teleport is really not going to work all that well against him most times. And the guy with the best teleport is kind of out of magic points. Might as well get some other spells leveled up. And on that note, might as well get to the uh, the usual. Uh, outro spiel here because we're just about done with this. We're going to go talk to the uh, the uh, the rulers one more time and that's pretty much going to be it. But if you're watching on YouTube, we will catch you guys tomorrow for another episode. And uh, if you are watching over on Twitch uh, when this plays in December, then we will be back in a couple minutes after some ads and whatnot. Thank you everybody for all the support, whether it's for Final Fantasy Count Up or Final Fantasy Month or just the YouTube video in general. I appreciate the hell out of it in every way, shape, and form. Thank you one and all. Catch you in a bit.